Hi guys and welcome back to Sightend where you're going to find all interesting things about life and work of a civil engineer and in today's video guys as you can see uh, I'm going to show you the largest crane in the world, the Big Cal here and uh, as some of you probably know uh, I ca I'm currently working here at Hinkley Point C project where the Big Cal operates and uh, as you can see it is really huge, uh, when I came here first time it made a really huge impression on me uh, you can see now yourself how big it is compared to all other cranes and how it looks actually uh, with all all construction site behind it uh, how big it is and unfortunately i cannot show you my own uh, pictures and uh, i cannot record really on site uh, i'm going to ask for it actually hopefully i'm going to get some permission and i'm going to show you uh, more interesting stuff as well but uh, i found uh, really good videos here uh, probably even better than I would do myself. So uh, let's have a look and we're gonna get some information about that biggest crane in the world, guys. Yes, big cow. Vital point, yes it is actually. Uh, we move in all the, the heavy precast, guys, is moved by the big cow. Uh, the installation of the huge walls, huge uh, concrete elements into the, the reactor building, uh, for instance, now where I'm working. And uh, yeah, all other stuff. You, you see the rails here, it's six kilometers of rails. Uh, it's crazy, guys. Uh, yeah, let's have a look what info we got here. Up to 100 meter Jeep. Oh yeah, look at this, guys, look. 52 counterweights, each 100 tons. So this is crazy. You can imagine now, you, 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 once you, you know this, you can yeah you can your imagination can work with this with this weight, so yeah that's that's the main boom here, uh, and I think that's the that's how it's going to be lifting the the most heavy things going to be lifting on the main boom, and I actually found uh, I'm going to show you at the end of this video a little animation uh, how the how the big car is operating. So before guys uh, I'm going to jump to that animation here I want to show you a few. Uh, Big lifts Carl actually did last week. Uh, we are lifting this. Uh, you can see here the liner ring, which comes into the reactor building. That's the lining inside, and then uh, we actually doing the wall uh, around it. So a very big lift here. Uh, very nice. Uh, you can see the liner inside, and uh, look at the look at the structure. You can see on my thumbnail here. Even that temporary structure to lift these elements, guys, is impressive. So you, you see the huge lifts. Uh, this is around 50 meters diameter. Uh, and uh, so you can imagine how big it is. And that's the reason why exactly we need the largest crane in the world, big cow. So let's have a look at that uh, animation now here. Uh, it's, it's, it's a really good uh, 3D animation. You can, you can see yourself here. You can see the three rings. Uh, the big cow operates mainly. Uh, so you could see before just 5,000 on the main boom. So maximum crane capacity 1781 tons but you can see how it drops nicely the elements and uh, that's how it operates guys uh, it's really good you see uh, relocation on site between lifting positions that's exactly what it is that's that's why you need all these rails all this oh that's actually quite interesting here next ring position for lifting operation that's exactly what it is <laughs> So as I said, guys, uh, really worth to see. Uh, I hope uh, some of you really gonna go onto site to start working here, and you're gonna see yourself. If not, just uh, I hope this video it's showing you how big it is and how interesting this project is as well. So uh, yeah, that's hopefully gonna happen in 2022. That dome gonna be lifted and uh, put on the Unit One uh, reactor building. So uh, yeah, you see that it got even a special system here while lifting uh, all this all lifting points of dome so that's exactly that liner a liner ring uh, i showed you before on that photo that's the part of uh, all that uh, reactor so that will be the dome so that will be the top in so actually it's on that animation it looks like he's putting the dome on unit one it's unit one going to be done first and then unit two so guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and if so, please don't forget to leave the thumbs up, leave some comments if you want to know something more about this project, about this uh, crane as well, uh, let me know uh, and I'm going to reply as soon as possible. And guys, uh, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel to grow our community of engineers here and uh, follow my LinkedIn page as well and see you next time.